here we are at a roundabout and we're going to measure the circumference of it but we're going to measure the inside and outside of this roundabout a circumference is the perimeter of a circle there you go we're starting at zero and then we're going to go start measuring It is starting at zero. Here we go. We end with 464.2. Four. Since the distance of the inner circumference is shorter than the distance of the outer circumference, if we wanted them both to start at the same point in time and end at the same time, the outer one would have to walk faster due to the fact that it's longer. To prove this, my little sister will walk the inner and I will walk the outer and I will have to walk faster. talked about the roundabout, we talked about how the person on the outer perimeter had to go faster than the person on the inner perimeter because it has more distance to travel. The same is true here. If somebody has a longer distance, then they have to go faster. Then there are two ways that we can make the distance that A has to travel longer than the distance that B has to travel, thus meaning that A has to go faster if we want them to start at the same time and end at the same time. One of the first way is to add an angle of attack, and the second is to put in a camber. 